even one set more than is required is overtraining. One of my favorite analogies here is within getting a suntan. You'll get a suntan every time you go out in the intense August sun, so long as you don't overexpose yourself. What happens when you expose your skin to even one minute more high intensity ultraviolet sunlight in August than is required to get a suntan? You burn. And that's all it takes. One extra minute, one minute in the sunlight, which is required minimally to get a suntan, you go into the negative, a sunburn. One set more high into even one set more than is minimally required to build up your muscles, you go into the negative, you lose muscle. Instead of overcompensating the body, building something up, in the first case a suntan, melanin, the second case muscle tissue, the body goes into the negative towards decompensation, it loses skin, the skin burns, or in the second case you get, you get weaker and smaller. Overtraining is not just something kind of negative. It's the single worst training mistake you can make. It is that precisely which militates against your achieving the desired result. And of course, the greater the overtraining, the, the more dire the consequences. It's possible to drive yourself into an overtraining situation so deep that it takes months to overcome. If you were to in fact, get a sunburn, you wouldn't keep going out into the sun, would you? Because the, the, the sunburn would keep getting worse, would it not?